वेलकम टू आवर चैनल एम सी क्यू वन इन टू डेट टॉफिक वी विल गिंग टू कवर नर्सिंग एम सी क्यू ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर पार्ट वन सो लेट स्टार्ट द वीडियो विच मेडिकेशन एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन रूट इज द फास्टेस्ट इन टर्म्स ऑफ एब्जॉर्बशन ओरल सबक्यूटीनियस इंट्रावेनस इंट्रामस्कुलर द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी इंट्रावेनस The recommended physician for a patient with a nasogastric tube is supine with head elevated, left lateral physician, front physician. None of these. The correct answer is option A, supine with head elevated. A nurse is preparing to administer insulin to a diabetic patient. Which route of administration is appropriate for insulin? Oral, intravenous, intramuscular. subcutaneous the correct answer is option d subcutaneous what is the first step in the nursing process assessment diagnosis planning implementation the correct answer is option a assessment is the first step in the nursing process The Glasgow Coma Scale GCS is used to assess muscle strength, neurological function, respiratory status, cardiac output. The correct answer is option B. The Glasgow Coma Scale GCS is used to assess neurological function. What is the medical term for high blood sugar? Hypoglycemia, hypertension, hyperglycemia, hypotension. The correct answer is option C. Hyperglycemia is the medical term for high blood sugar. Saliva helps in the digestion of fats, starch, proteins, vitamins. The correct answer is option B. Saliva helps in the digestion of starch. What does PPE stand for in healthcare settings? personal protection equipment primary fashion evaluation preventive fan elimination personal fashion examination the correct answer is option a personal protection equipment the term myocardial infarction refers to inflammation of the heart muscle abnormal heart rhythms heart attack in large heart the correct answer is option c The term myocardial infarction refers to heart attack. Which nursing intervention is most appropriate for a patient with a pressure ulcer? Turning and repositioning, applying a topical antibiotic, covering with a sterile dressing, elevating the head of the bed. The correct answer is option A, turning and repositioning. The nurse is performing an abnormal an abdominal assessment the nurse perform which assessment at first auscultation inspection palpation percussion the correct answer is option b inspection which of the following is a symptom of hypoglycemia polyuria excessive thirst blurred vision sweating and confusion The correct answer is option D. Sweating and confusion is a symptom of hypoglycemia. While giving a intradermal injection, the needle should be held at fifteen degree, forty-five degree, thirty degree, ninety degree. The correct answer is option A. While giving a intradermal injection, the needle should be held at fifteen degree angle. Which nursing theory is based on the idea of caring? Henderson's neat theory, Watson human caring theory, Nightingale's environmental theory, none of the above. The correct answer is option B, Watson human caring theory. Which of the following is a common side effect of opioid analgesics? Hypertension, bradyhypnia, hyperactivity, constipation. The correct answer is option D. Constipation is a common side effect of opioid analgesics. 
which position is recommended for a patient experiencing respiratory distress? Sufine, so Fron, Fowler's, none of these. The correct answer is option C, Fowler's. When you perform CPR on an unresponsive adult, you should correctly assess the pulse of which location, over the radial artery, over the carotid artery, over the brachial artery, over the temporal artery. The correct answer is option B, over the carotid artery. What is the purpose of the Braden scale in nursing? Assessing risk for pressure ulcer, evaluating pain intensity, monitoring blood pressure, measuring respiratory rate. The correct answer is option A, assessing risk for pressure ulcer. Which assessment finding indicates a potential complication of peripheral IV therapy? Localized warmth, increased urine output, decreased heart rate, increased appetite. The correct answer is option A, localized warmth. The correct sequence of performing CPR is airway breathing circulation, circulation breathing airway, breathing airway circulation, airway circulation breathing. The correct answer is option D, airway circulation breathing. A common side effect of corticosteroid therapy is hyperglycemia, hypokalemia, bradycardia, hypertension. The correct answer is option A, hyperglycemia. A patient with chronic renal failure is likely to experience folyuria, hypotension, hyperkalemia, alkalosis. The correct answer is option C, hyperkalemia. Which of the following is a common symptom of gastroesophageal reflex disease? Diarrhea, dyspagia, constipation, epigastric pain. The correct answer is option D. Epigastric pain is a common symptom of gastroesophageal reflex disease. The cranial nerve responsible for vision is cranial nerve 2, cranial nerve 5, cranial nerve 9, Cranial nerve 12. The correct answer is option A. Cranial nerve 2. Which of the following is a primary role for a nurse in, inf in infection control? Prescribing antibiotics, administrating vaccines, implementing hand hygiene practices, diagnosing infectious disease. The correct answer is option C. Implementing hand hygiene practices. Thanks for watching. Subscribe MCQs1 for latest informative MCQs.